Good morning, students. Good morning, ma'am. A very good morning. So, how are you all? Happy? Yes, ma'am. Enjoying the weather? Yes, ma'am. Is it getting cold now? Yes, ma'am. Nowadays, yes. so you don't feel like studying? No, ma'am. Yes, ma'am. No, but you feel like studying, right? Because you're good students. Okay. So now today we are going to do a very interesting thing. But before that. I am going to ask you that what do you see on the table? And if you have to answer, you all will yeah. raise your hands and then you will answer. Okay? I'll ask you one by one. Okay. So, um, Devyamshi at the end. Yes, Devyamshi. Put your, put your hands down everyone. Everyone else, please put your hands down. And two doll houses. Two doll houses. So Vyanshi, what do you see? Two doll House. houses. Okay. So this is one house. This is another house. And what else do you see? Adhya, what do you see, Bita? One car. You see one car. Excellent. Akshita, what do you see? One duck with three ducklings. One duck with three ducklings. Excellent. Kavyan, what do you see? One doll. One doll. A very pretty doll. Okay. Uh, Samriti, what do you see? One horse. You see one horse and a man riding the horse. Okay. There's one small little thing over here. If you can see, Aradhya. It is a bench. We have two chairs, one table, and a sofa. Okay. What? It is a dining table. Okay, fine. He has put a. He has put it. In an easy way, this is a dining table. Okay. Now, uh, if you look at um, all these things, you will realize that they are all placed next to each other. They are placed next, next to, each to each other. And everything that is displayed here has a position. Has a position. position which means that... There is something that is uh, kept in front of the house. There is something that is kept next to the house. There is something that is kept in between the two houses. So, everything has a designated position. What does it have? Designated position. So, whenever we talk about few words that tell us about the position of the object or many objects, those words are called prepositions. Those words are called prepositions because they are telling us about the positions of a noun or any object. Understood? Yes. Clear? Yes. And the prepositions that we are going to do today, they are called the prepositions of place. They are called the prepositions of place. Now, we use these prepositions in our daily routine life and you are very well aware of these prepositions. It's not that you don't use them at all. You use them, but today we will talk about the proper usage of prepositions in sentences. Okay? Understood everyone? Yes ma'am. Very good. Now, do you see this house? Yes. We are talking about this house now. There is something here. What is it? What is it? Car. Uh, wait, I'll ask. Um, what sir? What is it? Car. It is a car. car. Molly, can you tell me where is this car placed? In the house, but in the house, where in the house? 
in the bedroom in the bedroom so there is a bed in the bedroom good child sit down okay now um yeah we talk about this doll here fine now where is this doll standing uh aditya and behind of the house behind of the house no behind the house where is the doll standing behind the house, the house. very good now let's talk about this house here okay so what do you see here what is this akshar shrim dining table this is a dining table and where is this dining table mm one so
worksheet, Ashuta? Anyone? Can you please give me the revision worksheet that I gave you? Yes, that one. Okay, yeah, give me this. Okay. Now in this worksheet, we do the first one. The Christmas tree is? The dart is flying. The satellites are orbiting. The little girl is sheltering. The horse is jumping. If, if this happens, look here. Now this is the horse. And this horse is, is moving like this. And now it does this. So the horse has jumped over Yes, and if there is this car here, and the horse is jumping over And if this is the car moving, the, the horse is moving Excellent. The horse, and now the horse is here. The car, the man is driving the car. The man is driving the horse. After is also right. After the horse. And the car is moving behind the horse. So both are right in this case. Not a problem. Okay. Understood? <coughs> the next one is. The bird is swinging. Inside its cage. In its cage. In its cage. The preferable one will be inside its cage. Okay. The ball is going. The phone is standing. The phone is standing. Either beside or near. The dilation is running after the black cat. The number five is dash between four and six. So finally, you have understood prepositions. And the next set of prepositions we will be doing. Tomorrow. Okay, enjoy the activity. Yeah. Very good.